Hello, how are you guys? Hello, hello. Good morning. Um, well, I got, I'm not feeling very good, so I'm home today, so I'm working from home, um, so I have a pretty bad sore throat, so if I get sort of hoarse, um, that's what's going on, just so you guys are aware. Hi. Oh, I can't hear you. How are you? I'm good. You're at home. I am. I'm actually kind of sick. So I got sent home yesterday. Um, so I'll be home for a little while um, until I get a COVID test. Oof. Yeah. Well, it's possible, Brian, that I did to teach. Yeah, it's it's possible that I did. Um, I have a couple of the symptoms, but none of the really serious symptoms. Do you have major allergies? I don't normally. So that's part of the thing. Right now, I have a really bad sore throat and a headache and a little bit of a fever. So, okay. But fortunately, I wasn't really around anybody while I was at work this week or last week. Um, so that's good. Yeah. You but, did have a mask on, so. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm pretty, pretty good about wearing a mask all the time. Um, yeah. Well, I hope you feel better soon. Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> so, yep. So I've got to isolate for 10 days or until I get a COVID test back. Yeah. Um, I just, the places near me, I can't get one until Sunday. Um, so I kind of just have to wait. Yeah. My dad says the COVID test is like really terrible. Oh yeah. Did he have Dick to get one? You have to stick a thing. Yeah. Um, also, are we going to be working on our projects today? Mm -hmm. Yep. You'll In our groups? groups? Yep, you sure okay. will. Okay. So we'll t talk about uh, 
we'll talk about uh, the project and then you'll have the hour to work on your um, presentation. So yeah, Brian, you are, Brian, you're in the no group. So you get to, uh, you get to research more about, about no drama. So lucky you. You get to do puppets. Yeah. I like that puppets tend to have a little more diversity in their characters. <laughs> like there are females in puppetry. <laughs> I know they're being like controlled by a guy or whoever the puppet master is, but they're still females. <laughs> My little sister wasn't even born when Frozen came out, and now it is her favorite thing. No. I have listened to both Frozen 1 and Frozen 2 for the past consecutive two days. I haven't seen Frozen 2 yet. Um, I watched it, the first one. I watched the first one in theaters. I can't remember the last time I saw a movie in theaters at this point. Yeah. I think it was... I really don't know. Like, I think the last time I actually went to go watch a movie in theaters was for... No. When did Endgame happen? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I think it might have been Endgame was the last thing that I saw in theaters. It's either Endgame or Frozen. Wait, it might have been the Spider-Man movie that came out after Endgame. I didn't watch that in theaters. That might have been the last one that I saw. Because my dad really likes the Spider-Man movies, so he and I go. But they're making a new Croods movie, and it's coming out this November. What? Oh. Uh, the Croods? They're making a new movie for it, and it's coming out in November, and I'm happy because I love that movie. I suspect that we're going to see a lot of um, streamers. I was going to say we're going to see a lot of animated movies because that's like we can like you can safely do it, you know. Yeah. I did see that the Minecraft Steve was going to be in Smash, and it like, yeah broke Twitter. Yes, Steve deserves to be in Minecraft, no doubt about it. I have Minecraft on Switch, so yay. One of the, um, during one of the streams that we did for um, St. Jude, years ago notch actually came in and donated like ten thousand dollars or something notch mm -hmm. yeah yeah it was pretty wild i might have a heart attack <laughs> yeah it was pretty cool he uh he came in and just dropped like 10 grand we've got a few people that do that there's this one guy who um Gosh, what is his name? I can't remember what his username on uh, Twitch is, but he'll just come in and um, just like either donate tons of money or he'll like sub bomb the stream. So he'll donate like um, 300, 400, 500 um, like um, subs at a time. Huh. Yeah. That's fun. Cool. But, man, the internet's a magical place. It's pretty wild. Yeah. Notch gave your charity live stream money. Yeah. Notch! 
I've only like really met one famous person. I saw one famous person, but that's because I didn't go to their uh, booth because I don't watch the show that they're in, but I know who they are. So I've actually seen, I think, the ninth Doctor in Doctor Who. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I saw him at a convention that I went to a long time ago. And it was because the reason why I went to the convention is because I was part of this cosplay club for a long time with my friend Brittany. And, like, we, I already planned it, but the teacher left the school. Oh, yeah. So I just went because I wanted to at that point. Um, the last time that I was at St. Jude, well, like Dr. Lupo is somebody that I've worked with before. Um, he's pretty cool. He, his wife is really cool. She and I hung out, uh, we were in the same group that toured the hospital in Memphis. Mm -hmm. Um, and then I've met Ninja once. So... We're going to wait just one or two more minutes. Um, today is going to be your day to work on your projects together. Um, but before I send you to your rooms, I just wanted to sort of quickly go over what I really want you to be doing, right? So um, this is in the PowerPoint, but some of the other groups said that it really helped when I explained it one more time. Essentially, I want you to sort of imagine that somebody uh, is going to Japan for the first time and they ask you or your group for uh, an opinion about what traditional Japanese theater they should see. They only have time to see one and you're creating an argument for your, for whichever one you're assigned, okay? So some things that you can talk about, and I'm gonna post this in the chat so you can copy paste it if you want to. Um, the history of the, of the type of theater, okay? What it looks and sounds like, the kinds of plays they perform. You can also show information about where to see this theater now because some of the theaters that show these plays are really interesting. So you can look up, like, let's say, you know, you're going to go see a performance of no theater. This is the theater that you can watch it at. This is what that theater looks like and where it is. You can even talk about ticket prices if you wanted to. So you have quite a few options, right? And then I want you to sort of sum it up with, sort of why you think um, this is the one worth their time, okay? Questions about any of that? Before I send you to your breakout rooms. Now, obviously, I'm going to come through your breakout rooms and give you some, um, some help, right? You can put it in a Google Doc. You can make a slide presentation if you want. I have one group that is making, actually they decided they wanted to do like a sort of a YouTube video um, or PowerPoint, like whichever format you feel like sort of works the best. Um, I'm fine with any of that, okay? They're the groups from last time. Yeah, I was, Alyssa, I was explaining what I really want out of the project. I'll paste it again in the chat so you can see it. Um, so it's a, it's an argument about why this is the kind, this is the, the historical type of theater they should go see in Japan. Okay. And that's including the history, maybe what it looks and sounds like what kind of plays you can see, um, where they can see this kind of theater today, and why you think that this form is the one that's like the best out of the three, okay? 
So that's sort of what I want you to cover. If there's other stuff that you think, you know, hey, I really want to talk about, um, you know, how Bunraku, like this is the only place in the world where you can see puppetry performed like this, please do it. You know, for no drama, you might want to include something about how it's, um, you know, passed down from father to son and why that's really interesting to you. For Kabuki, maybe you want to talk about the makeup, right? Because like you're really interested in makeup. That's great. Okay. Um, any other questions? Those are good questions. So I will put you in your groups as you are in your groups. If you think of questions, feel free. You raise your hand. It sort of summons me to you. Um, if you um, think of something and you want to just like pop back into the main room and ask me, you can also do that. Okay. Uh, I'm fine with either. If there's a problem in your group, like let's say nobody seems to be talking, you can also come get me and I'll help sort of facilitate like, okay, like let's break it down into who is going to do what. Because um, I don't want anybody to end up having to do all of the work. Oops, sorry, Jada, I didn't mean to. Yeah, you're going to be in, uh, in the groups that I put you in briefly at the end of last class. Okay. So I am assigning those right now. Um, for those of you who have people who are missing, I would uh, encourage you to try to reach out to them. But if you can't get a hold of them, then just proceed with it yourself. Just document who does what, OK? Um, so that way I know who is responsible for what part of each presentation and I'm giving I'm putting the groups in now it just takes me a minute to type all this I sort of wish that you could like like drag the names over that would be kind of cool but And hopefully, I think we'll probably have a few people who show up late, and then I will put them in their rooms as well. So if you're missing a bunch of people, yes, you can. All right, guys. So here you go. Here's your groups. Enjoy. And like I said, I'll be around every like 10 minutes or so. Ahmed, Hannah, are you there? Oh, here we go. Got some people joining. Hey guys, I'm gonna put you in your group in just a second. Siri goes to Bunraku. And Jaden is in Kabuki. There you go. Hannah, are you there?
Hi, Aiden. How are you? Um, let me assign you a group. I'm going to go ahead and put you in the, let's see, which one's missing? The no one group. Are you there? Can you say something in the chat so I know you're there? or turn on your camera. Hi, Aiden. Okay, we are working on a group project. So I'm going to go ahead and assign you a group and they can catch you up on what we are working on. Okay. All the information is in Schoology and they can sort of show you where that is as well. So let me give you a group here. Okay, you can't hear me.
Hey guys, how are you doing? We're good. We're working on the slides right now. Okay, great. Wonderful. Any questions? Um, as of right now, no. Okay. Uh, we're going to try to get in contact with Julian because he's one of our group mates and I don't okay. think he came to class today. Okay. He was in briefly because I saw his name. So maybe he's having internet problems because um, he's usually around. So, um, okay, great. Wonderful. Uh, and remember, this isn't due until Sunday either. Okay. So if you want to like, you know, give him a topic and then, you know, message him and be like, hey, guy, I need you to do this. And I think he'll probably get it done. Yeah. I, uh, we're going to ask him to work on the same slide as a, uh, Ahmed. Okay. So they can get that done together. Sounds good. All right. Thank you, guys. Hi. How are we doing? Uh, we had a question. Okay. So you know how you said like to describe the noise? The sound or the, or the look? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So um, can you tell us like which ones did you say? Because like we couldn't, we can't go to the chat that was in the original room. Um, you're doing kabuki. Is that what you mean? Yeah. So just like we do, we do how it's like sounds. What else? Oh, okay. Yeah. Here, let me give you the. There you go. Does that help? Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. I will be back. Hey guys, do you guys have any questions or concerns or having any problems? No? So everybody's got a job? Everybody's working together? Just remember this is due Sunday at midnight, so you do have a little time to work on it, right? Um, I think Let's see. Um, your whole group is here, so you don't have to work, reach out to anybody else, which is great. Um, and if you have anything that you want me to look at ahead of time and give you feedback on, I'm happy to do so, okay? Sound good? Okay, great, wonderful. Well, let me know if you do think of any questions, okay? Hi, everybody. I just wanted to pop in and see if anybody has any questions that I can answer or any concerns, any confusion that I can help with. See, we're making a Google Doc. Is that what's going on? Okay, wonderful, Jada. I'm glad to hear it. If you have anything you want me to look at, um, I'm happy to do so. Or if you need me to answer any questions, just let me know. Um, 
remember this isn't due until Sunday at midnight, so you do have a little time to do it, but I would suggest that you go ahead and use this time to really focus on it so you can just sort of get it off your plate. You don't have to add me to it, but if you want to, you, you can, I don't mind. It's totally up to you. Some people, you know, they want to work on it privately and then send it to me maybe like Friday night and have me look at it. And some groups have added me straight from the beginning. So it really depends on what your preference is. Okay, well, I will go check in with the other groups and then um, if you have any questions, just let me know. Hello, hello, how are we doing? As in, I can hardly hear you. Oh, so right now I had my earbuds in. Um, I have notes down, but I haven't heard anything from anybody else. Yeah, no. Well, the, for the longest, it's just been the Edison in here and I didn't see anyone else. Yeah, they came in late. Um, I know Aiden can't hear. He said he couldn't hear me. So you might have to type in the chat to talk to him. And I don't know what's going on with Hannah. Okay. So I'm sorry I can't be more helpful with that. Um, just make sure that you document who does what on in the project. Okay. Uh, okay. All right. Okay. Good. Sit in and be like, hey, this is a summary of this, but make sure to okay. give ways to the citations. Okay. Hello, anything I can help you guys with? Not particularly, unless, Theory, you have questions about like types of performances. Okay, so I had questions, plenty of questions because I came in late. Okay. So I didn't really, um, have a good explanation of what we're supposed to be doing because I came in late. So I was asking what we're supposed to be doing and Emma, she's explaining correctly, but I just need a more understanding from a teacher. Okay. So what you're doing is you are creating a sort of a, um, a convincing argument, right? As to why someone should go see Bunraku over, you know, um, why somebody should go see Bunraku in Japan, right? I just posted in the chat the things that I sort of talked about uh, of ways, like things that you could use to strengthen your argument, like the history of the theater, what it looks and sounds like, the types of plays that are performed there. Um, you could also look up where you can actually see these types of plays today and use that. Um, because the play, like the theaters themselves are, are actually like really beautiful. Um, so that's a good thing to also include. But basically you're imagining that somebody who is going to Japan is saying, hey, um, you know, I'm going to go to Japan. I'm going to be there for a week. I have enough time to see one like play. What should I go see? And you're like, oh, you should go see Bunraku because A, B, C, you know, does that make sense? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Um, okay. Yeah, that's sort of, so imagine that you're sort of trying to convince somebody that like, this is the best one and here's all the reasons why. Okay, thank okay. you. You're very welcome. All right. If you guys have any more questions, just let me know and I will come back and I'll be back in another like 10 minutes.
All right. I just wanted to check in one more time and just make sure that there's nothing else I can help you guys with or if there's anything you wanted me to look at before. Uh, would you like me to share the slides with you sure, so you could see where we're at? That'd be great. Okay. Could you put your email in the chat bar, please? Absolutely. Thank you. You're welcome. If I can type, that is. There you go. I shared it with you. Wonderful. Let me see. It usually takes just a second before I get the email. Yep, there we go. Let me see what we got. Oh, I like the beginning. That's very cool the way you guys did that. Oh, I like uh, the historical context. That looks very cool. You might be able to do two slides for about the plays if you wanted to. Um, it's a little bit of a lot of text, sort of up to you. Okay, and then you've got a list of like what you want to do for the theater ticket prices. Okay, this is like a good start for sure. I like all the pictures. That's really nice. Very smart. So yeah. Okay. Good work. Oh, thank you. You're very welcome. All right. I will talk to you guys in just a little bit when we come all back together, okay? Hey, everybody. I just wanted to see if there's any questions I can answer, if there's anything you want me to look at before we break for today. We've got about mm, 10 minutes left. You're almost done, Brian? Wow. You're really making good time. Good job. Okay. Well, if you guys want me to look at your slides at any time before you want us before you submit them in or however you're doing it, there's my email. You can always add me and I can give you some feedback so that way you can sort of um, edit it a little bit before you submit it on Sunday night. Otherwise, um, I'll go check in on the other groups and then you have about five minutes before I'll bring us all back together. Okay. Hey, how are we doing? Any questions I can answer? Anything you want me to look at? Uh, we're close to finishing. Great, wonderful. Well, if you guys want me to look at what you're working on um, and give you some feedback before you submit it, there's my email, of course. Um, and then otherwise, like I said, do Sunday at midnight. Um, and just make sure you have, you know, who did what work on the presentation, okay? Sounds good? Thank you. You're welcome, Mildred. Hello. Just wanted to check in to see if there's any information I can give you guys or any questions I can answer. You're good? All right. Okay, wonderful. Well, you got a couple more minutes, then I'll bring us all back together, just sort of a brief recap, and then that'll be it for today. So we've got about eight minutes left, okay? 
Great. Wonderful. I'm glad that you guys were really using this time. Good for you. Just make sure that you have a credit on each slide for who did what. Okay. Okay. Wonderful. All right. Hello, hello, how are we doing? I have most of everything. We're just putting it together in a presentation. Okay, great. Well, if you want to send me your presentation before you submit it on Sunday and get some feedback, of course, you have my email and I can post it again here. Um, and then, like I said, just make sure that you put who did what on each slide. Mm -hmm. so that way I can, what is I'm grading? All right. Okay. 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 You got a couple minutes left and then I'll bring us all back together and just sort of wrap things up. Hello. Hello. How are we doing? Did we lose theory? Oh, theory. Um, uh, she needed to go for a little bit. Okay. All right, any questions, anything that I can answer for you guys? Any problems y'all are having? No. Everybody working? No. No, you're not working or no, you don't have questions? I mean, I have only one question. Okay, yes. So the question is, um, am I allowed to, do I have to explain my, if I choose to, do I have to ex back up my, the two places I choose for Benaraku that mm -hmm. I still perform, do I have to explain them? Um, I mean, maybe talk a little bit about them. So like, you know, why you, you know, where they are, um, maybe why they're popular, that might be good. Um, uh, but does that make sense? Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. You got a couple more minutes and then I'm going to bring us all back together and just sort of do a quick like huddle about what's going on next. Okay. All right, we will wait just a couple more seconds while everybody gets back in. I just wanted to really clearly sort of make sure that everybody understands. First of all, make sure you're putting credit on each slide for who did what, okay? Um, and of course, cite your sources. So if you are using sources for this, make sure that you cite that too, okay? Um, also, we're gonna move on to Indian drama 
next. All right. So make sure to watch that Crash Course Theater. It's Crash Course Theater number 24. And you can find it by just putting that in YouTube. It will bring, come in right up. Um, so watch that before Friday. The project is due Sunday at midnight. So the project is due Sunday at midnight. So you got a little time. Please watch Crash Course Theater number 24 before we meet on Friday and take some notes. So that way you'll already be familiar with some of the terminology that we talk about when we talk about ancient Indian drama, okay? Um, and we got two minutes left. If anybody has any questions, let's talk about them. Uh, make sure one person is turning the project in for each group. If you are uncertain that the person you've assigned has turned it in and you wanna turn it in, as well, you can, I understand. Um, but we don't have an exit ticket for today. So if you don't have any questions, that's it from me for today. I appreciate you guys hanging out with me and I will see you on next week, right? It's Thursday, see you next week now. Okay, um, I guess I'm gonna go. All right, Emma, you have a good weekend, okay? Okay. Bye. Bye. Feel better so soon. Thank you. Thank you so much.